Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and if you've got an Apple product and I know a lot of people that follow this channel also have Apple products. Well, an update is required, a very important update for security. So it's two zero days that actually are exploiting that can hack iPhones and Mac computers. It is exploited in the wild. So this is the third zero day exploited in the wild that has been discovered this year for Apple products. Um, one of them is a update that actually uh, compromises IO surface accelerator out of bound right and it leads to corruption of data or a crash and or code execution. And uh, so that's the first one. So that after that crash, there could be code injected and then you are of course infected and whatever they do whatever they want the second zero day it allows data corruption or arbitrary code execution when reusing memory that has been freed up by the device itself and this could be actually exploited by tricking a target into going into a specific web page and tricking you which would uh, actually uh, allow control and download of the malicious uh, code. The zero days uh, are addressed in um, iOS 16.4.1, iPadOS 16.4.1, and macOS Ventura 13.3.1, and Safari 16.4.1. Now, the list of affected devices, if you want to know if you're part of it, iPhone 8s and later, iPad Pro All Models, iPad Air 3rd generation and later, iPad 5th generation and later, iPad mini 5th generation and later, and Macs that are running Mac OS Ventura. So make sure that you update your devices to stay safe because this means that you could go on uh, Wi-Fi, you can go on public Wi-Fi, you can or even go to a page that will um, you know allow you to download some specific package. Um, without even you knowing that it's happening because you stumbled upon a page that shouldn't be. And all of that will actually make your devices not only vulnerable, but they can take control. So fix your devices. It's very important in order to stay safe. This is the number one security. And uh, this will let you, of course, stay safe on all of your devices when you are running your iPhones, iPads, and Mac computers. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.